And <laughs> there was once a man who wanted to go fishing, an Englishman. And he just didn't know the area. And he fished all day and had very poor luck. And he was coming home with not anything to really brag about, some small ones that he kept and really shouldn't have. But as he came upon a man standing there, he said, please tell me a better place to fish. I promised I made big braggy things about finding fish and I don't have any. And this man said, ah, you go around the corner, there's another lake, and there are some French brothers, they're very stupid. There are six of them and they fish every day and they have fantastic luck. If you talk to them nicely or maybe outwit them, they could give you some fish. Well, the man said, I just want to try my hand. So he went down to the other lake and he saw these six Frenchmen. And one of them was crying copious tears and he didn't know why. So he approached him and he said, excuse me, I really would like to fish and I'm told you're a fabulous fisherman. And the older French brother said, oh, we should have, we, today, we've lost the brother. We came with six brothers and, and one of them is missing. He looked and he could visually see six men standing there. So he said, okay. And the Englishman said, well, could we count your brothers? And the Frenchman said, we, well, when we were fishing, uh, I was in the boat. Uh, one was on the, the bank, one was on the dock, uh, one was on the, by the, the, the tree, uh, one was on the bend of the river, one was by the rock. Said, well, count them. So he decided to count in English instead of French and went over and he said, he would, would say where they were. Back, one, one, two, three, four, five. There are only five and we came with six. And he cries some more. And the Englishman said, well, do it again. So he goes backwards from the bin, from the tree. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. There are only five. And he carries on. And any of you who have really listened realize what is he not doing? What is he not doing? He's not counting himself. So the Englishman said, I think I can find your sixth brother. <laughs> if you would tell me how I can catch fish the way you all do, I would be glad to help you find the sixth brother. <laughs> and they said, well, we will give you all our fish. Oh, no, no, no. I only want a fair share. So he said, I tell you what, you, you line up and I will squeeze your hand. And when I squeeze your hand, you say, here, we'll start with one. Say one, down the line. And they said, all right. So they line up. He goes with the one that had been in the boat, the encounter, squeezes his hand. One, two, three, four, five, six. You have found the sixth brother. Oh, saints be praised. And they gave him half their fish. And the Englishman felt that maybe he'd been a bit wrong, that these brothers were too stupid to count. But he wanted the fish. So he said, thank you, monsieur. And may you have good fishing every day of your life. <laughs>